I think our most embarrassing moment so far was when we got stuck on the table, just straddling just now, each other. Doing contact, yeah. Dom, who plays Mark, thrust me so hard I fell over. <laughs> but it wasn't just a like a gentle fall, it was a flail. My version of interpretive dance was pretty embarrassing <laughs> in Santa Fe. Um, my voice broke during a song where I had a solo line and it broke rather astronomically. We've had a sprained ankle. We've had a sprained ankle. Sprained yeah. ankle. We uh, had the first gay kiss. That was had the first awkward. gay kiss. Was that a lesbian kiss or a gay kiss? It was well, we had one of each. We had one of each. Yeah, yeah. That was pretty awkward. Pretty good. Um, <laughs> Haven't we all kissed girls? Like... Not me. When drunk. <laughs> must have done at some point. You must have... I may You definitely have. have. I know you have. <laughs> You know I have. Because you told me. Just now, Holly caught me with my hand down my pants trying to adjust my boxes. I've actually got my whole church group coming to see this. So, um, uh, you know, information for the masses. It's a great show. And uh, it's all about good morals, really, for the most part. So I think it'll be fine. <laughs> it's better than them kissing any of these boys, anyway. Don't know. I tried it. <laughs> <laughs> actually, to be honest, I think Holly's the one who's getting the most embarrassed out of everybody with all the touchy feely stuff. The director. <laughs> My favourite song in Wren. Actually, it, originally it was I'll Cover You, um, but the more we're doing it, I really love Wren, which is the opening number. The really fun thing about doing this is there are so many songs that people won't know, um, but I think it's really good that we get to show some unknown number. I'd say Wren, actually, to perform, but one of my favourite tunes is What You Own. I love Take Me or Leave Me. I've always loved that, ever since the first time I heard it. And also, I love um, I'll Cover You. My favourite song's Contact. <laughs> We're not in it though, so probably my favourite one to perform is La Vie Bohème. I like, I... I like the Rent song, the main Rent song. I like La Vie Bohème. Yeah. yeah. I think it's a really good song. And how they set it on stage is yeah. really, really good. I really like La Vie Bohème um, because it's just so much fun. La Vie Bohème. was my best friend, I would say she's fab. The piece of advice I'd give to Mark would be maybe man up a bit. I'd, I'd tell my character to stop taking drugs. To <laughs> <laughs> the main character I play is Alexi Darling, um, and she's a bit of a cow, really, and I'd just tell her to lighten the hell up. <laughs> um, Don't take drugs. My character doesn't take drugs. <laughs> Lay off your son, Mark's mum. Just say he's all right. I would tell Paul that he <laughs> needs to. Guy. Paul needs to cheer up. <laughs> <laughs> he's a miserable guy. <laughs> Yours would be uh, put some clothes on. Put some clothes on. Go to rehab. Genuinely sort your life out. I think the think advice. Of what you could do. <laughs> the, adv <laughs> <laughs> the advice I give my character is just chill out a little bit. Cheer, cheer the hell up. <laughs> I'd advise my character to loosen up, but he does, and he shows his nice side in act two. Keep going. Keep, yeah. Keep pushing. Keep swimming. Yeah, just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. <laughs> <laughs> to dump Maureen. Oh. If it, yeah. I reckon my character would be a fox. Kind of coming out at night, being a bit naughty oh, in the city. Best. Yeah. A platypus, I suppose, because my one's a bit useless. A panda, like, because he's quite secluded, like, doesn't always hang around in groups. There isn't many of us left, um, and he only has sex about once a year. Maureen is definitely a tiger. She's a bit slinky, but then she can pounce on you. I'd say some sort of monkey, like, the movie <laughs> about where I'm just jumping yeah, around all over the monkeys. place. I don't think it would be a cat, would we? It wouldn't be like, no, we're not slinky nice enough. normal. <laughs> I'm thinking a giraffe because my character does a lot of standing on things, so I imagine that I could just be the neck of the giraffe. Isn't it? It's kind of a bit showy offy, like a peacock. Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's, I, it's a bit flamboyant, I know. I know TT and likes the attention. Chameleon. Because I play lots of different characters. Ha. A lion. No? A bear. <laughs> a, a grizzly bear. A grumpy grizzly bear. It's just, <laughs> it's just, it's just woken up. Yes. A lion. No, a bear. No, definitely a bear. <laughs> A meerkat, no. <laughs> I like 
crunchy peanut butter. Sweet. Is there an option to not have peanut butter? <laughs> I hate peanut butter. Oh, I hate peanut butter. Yeah, me too. No peanut butter at all. I hate peanut butter. Peanut butter is disgusting. I've never liked nuts, actually. I don't like peanut butter. Um, anything with nuts in. Grim. No, I don't. Yeah, good move. I don't <laughs> like it at all. Peanut yeah. butter. Neither? I don't like it. Not a fan of peanuts. Smooth. Smooth all the way. I have always loved the show Rent um, from when a friend of mine introduced me to it and it just blew me away. I just loved it from then on. How about you? Um, because I get to snog you. <laughs> of course, <laughs> literally. I just think it's an amazing musical. I haven't seen anyone else do it, so I just thought it was a chance I couldn't miss. Well, I've always wanted to do Rent because I've known about the show for years and years and years. I'd never worked with mixed voice before and I'd heard really good things. I'd seen various cast members in various shows around Norwich and they just looked like a really good group of talented people. I've always admired the show ever since I've heard of it and I thought it'd be really fun to meet a cast that was predominantly adults and I've always heard they were high quality, so I was excited. <laughs> I was really excited about the concept of Rent because it's so different to the standard musical you get where everyone's happy and dancing and tap numbers everywhere. This has got real emotion in it and I think there's a song in, in this musical that will affect everybody. Seasons of